Hey guys, welcome back to the Music Mindset channel. You know what we do here. Now, I had talked about this in the past, and this is going to be a special treat. It's definitely a special treat for me. I got my right-hand partner, uh, RJ, who wants to come in and listen to some of what we're doing here. And she has never heard any of this music that I've been listening to. In fact, she was born around that time that these songs were coming out in the early 70s and whatnot. So we're going to bring her in there and we're going to let her listen to, for the first time, Bohemian Rhapsody. Now, Bohemian Rhapsody, I know you guys love that song. That's the one song that I know by Queen. I didn't really know much about Queen at the time, but I remember I was a little kid. And we were in school, and on Fridays, the teacher would let the kids pick a song and to play, the little 45s to play. And this was one of the songs, and the kids would always pick this and some Elton John and stuff like that. And at first, I was like, man, what is all this they, they're playing? But then I learned to love it. But when they finally played uh, Bohemian Rhapsody, all I know is every time and every time since I hear that song, it always makes me want to cry when I listen to what he's singing about and stuff like that. Now, I'll be honest, I haven't heard this song. It's got to be 20 or 30 years since I heard this song, but it left, left a lasting impression on me that I don't think will ever go away. So I'm going to let RJ listen to Freddie Mercury and Queen. Come on in here, RJ. She's going to come in here and uh, sit with us for a minute. And this is going to be a big treat because she knows nothing about uh, this. She doesn't know, know a whole lot about music in general as it is, uh, but she's going to have some fun with us tonight. And she's in her little disguise and stuff like that because she don't want to be on camera. But uh, here she is. So I'm going to get her the headsets. And I'm going to play Bohemian Rhapsody and let her listen to it for the first time because I've been telling about uh, why people love Queen so much. Uh, I love the music. Now I love the band because I've had a chance to, you know, get some history and some facts on them. So we're going to get right into it. And I hope y'all enjoy this because I think this is going to be fun because she doesn't believe it's going to have that any type of effect, but we'll find out. And she's going to be watching the video. So here we go. Ready, RJ? Yeah. Okay. Is it started? Is this okay. the real life? So you ready? Yeah. Here we go. Is this just fantasy? Caught in a landslide, no escape from reality. Open your eyes, look up to the skies and see. I'm just a cool I need no sympathy. Because I'm easy come, easy go, little high. Anyway, the wind blows doesn't really matter to me. To me, Mama just killed a man, put a gun against his head, pulled my trigger. Gotta leave you all behind and 
will you do the bandango? Thunderbolts and lightning, very, very frightening me. Galileo, 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 Galileo Figaro. Oh, oh, oh. I'm just a poor boy, and nobody loves me. He's just a poor boy from a poor family, sparing his life from this monstrosity. Mamma mia, let me go. Beelzebub has a devil put aside for me, for me, for me. Yeah, so that's why they love Queen because Freddie Mercury, that was incredible. Wow. What do you think? So I'm gonna let you, what do, what do you think about that song? That's uh, a great song. Well, I don't know what's the meaning behind it, but so far it's a great song. I love the lyrics, the beat. So I was telling her how great it was and, and she, you know, uh, was like, okay, whatever, whatever. So I said, let me just put it in here and just uh, have a little fun with that and and show the effect that this music has on people. So most of the songs are like that. I mean, you you did say you heard uh, what another one bites the dust. Yeah. And we one, are the yeah. champions and mm -hmm. stuff like that. Those are great songs. But she had never heard this one before. But I this is one of the uh, songs that they're most known by. They're known by the other song, but this is a song that gets people most of the time. It, uh, it's been in movies, on sitcoms, and I think even Saturday Night Live, they use it in a sketch and stuff like that. But that's uh, the big song right there by a group called Queen. So now you know Queen. So what do you think? What do you want to say before we wrap it up? Yeah, I'm saying they're a really good group. Um, what I've heard so far, I love it. So I would listen to it again. Mm -hmm. And you go out and buy that if you had to, right? If I had to, yeah, I would. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. So I appreciate that. And uh, uh, sticking in there with me, we were kind of winging it a little bit, but before, I was thinking about uh, doing a, another Queen song. And then I said, let me get this in because I had talked to her about it. And so we finally got it in. I hope it was to your enjoyment. Uh, and I hope you stick around with the channel, subscribe. And, and every time you see a video pop up, uh, check us out. Uh, I'm Mr. Mindset on the Music Mindset channel. And from time to time, I'm going to have RJ join me in because like like I say, if it has an effect on her, you know it must be good because she's not a big fan of uh, any much outside of gospel or, or things like that or, or some R&B. And uh, she's pretty much, I see by the expression on her face that she enjoyed it. So that goes to show you, yeah, Queen is what you think it is. It doesn't just have an effect on 
certain type of people, anybody that listens to those type of songs, I feel like they're going to feel the same way. So I'm going to check you guys out next time. Thanks for joining the channel tonight, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks.